Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can add your help desk information to the Microsoft 365 uh, Office bar. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. I don't know if you noticed, but if you click in the upper right hand corner, let's say you're in SharePoint and you click on this question mark, you of course get all this, you know, help from Microsoft, uh, right? You can type in your, you know, your questions, keywords, and then it will find support articles. But at the very bottom of the page, there is this section where you can specify uh, the information for your uh, company help desk. All right, if you help a uh, help desk, maybe some IT information, so you know who to contact, email address, URL, and maybe even a phone number, you can actually add it in this particular section. Let me show you how. All right, what you need to do is navigate to Microsoft 365 Admin Center. You do need to have a Microsoft 365 admin role for this. So let me open this up, all right, and then navigate to settings org settings and then over here click on organization profile and you need to choose help desk information option right and essentially this is where you add the information but i actually already added uh, the information it was blank obviously uh before this but you can uh, add a catchy you know title uh, and then provide the whatever the phone number email uh, if you are utilizing maybe some sort of uh, help desk Maybe it's built in SharePoint, or maybe it's a third party you know, tool that you use. You can actually provide the URL to that as well. Uh, so users can just click and maybe log in a ticket or something. And that's all you need to do, all right? You just put the changes in here, uh, input your information, click Save. And what I really like about uh, this particular option is that you could be in SharePoint, click on the question mark, information's there. Uh, you could be in Outlook, all right? I am maybe checking my email and everything. I click on the question mark. Once again, the information is there. So this bar is present in most of uh, Microsoft 365 uh, applications. So no matter where you are, your users can quickly uh, obtain the help desk information without uh, maybe searching for it or going to a home site uh, or your landing page uh, to find it. All right. Uh, so that's all I really wanted to show you uh, in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. Uh, in my opinion, a nice and quick um, you know, change to make uh, that improves your user experience and user adoption. Uh, but for now, thank you very much for watching the video. And I hope to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com. Goodbye.